Mm-hmm. Okay, folks, today we're going to, I'm going to teach you how to check voltage on a single phase panel. We did a video earlier on how to check voltage on a three phase panel. I'm using my meter here, fill piece. And what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go to the main, this is the main conductors coming in. This particular service happens to be a 200 amp service. Okay, so I'm going across the main lugs. You look at the meter here, you should have 249, 250 volts, okay? You're going to go from one hot leg to the other. You have 124 volts. One hot leg to the other, 124 volts. So now what that means is sending 240 volts down the main bus bar on each side of the breakers. So when you come here, you should have 240 volts on this double pole breaker. You see how this is a double pole, meaning this breaker takes up two spaces. Double pole, double pole. These down here are what we call tandem single pole breakers. Let's do a voltage check on a couple more of these uh, double poles, for instance. 240. And I'm going to go to the other side and just show you it doesn't matter which side of the breaker box you're on. You're going to get to 240 volts. 250 volts, whatever. Okay. Now we're going to check the 110 volts. So you've got to have a neutral. This is your neutral. That neutral is tied over to this bar here through a bracket in the back. Hundred and twenty five volts. Hundred and twenty five volts. I'm going to the neutral bar on this side. Hundred and twenty five volts. 125 volts. Okay, I'm just going to show you this here is what we, like I said, a tandem single pole. And here next to this, this is just a regular single pole breaker. These are square D. If you have any questions on how to check the voltage on a single phase panel, give us a call at Jones Air Conditioning and Electrical, 239-596-5855 or jonesairconditioning.com. Thank you.